But the pressure to get married is real. I myself got engaged. Uh, thank you. <laughs> By changing my Facebook status to engaged. <laughs> It's easy. Anyone can do it tonight, even. <laughs> and everyone was so excited for me. I should preface this by saying I was having a little cup of wine, and by cup, I mean bottle. And I was like, I'm just gonna change my status. <laughs> I should say I had quit drinking, and then, like, I missed it. I was like, I just want to go have some wine on some dates. What's the big deal? So, like, I went and had some wine on some dates, right? And then it just became one long date with wine alone in my apartment <laughs> for a decade. <laughs> long story short, I did end up getting married uh, to wine. <laughs> And true to statistics, it did end up in divorce. <laughs> so back to my Facebook engagement. So back to my fake book engagement, right? So I'm having a little cup of wine. I switch my status on Facebook to engage. Um, the reason I thought that was no big deal is because the night before I had changed it to single, which elicited no response whatsoever. <laughs> Nary a like. So I didn't think it was a big deal. I switch it to engage. I fall asleep. The next morning, there's like all these comments, all these likes. People are so happy for me. <laughs> and I was like panicked. I'm like, oh my God, do I tell them I lied? That's not, that's not my brand. I just, I just need to get away from the internet to the safety of the real world. So I go to Trader Joe's, and this girl's like, I saw you got engaged. I'm so excited for you. What's his name? I'm like scanning the store, like, his name's Joe Yogurt. His name's Joe Yogurt. Falafel. It's so exciting. How did he propose? Well, he rented the silent movie theater and he came on screen as the actor and uh, he proposed and then he had a hot air balloon waiting outside and we just hopped in and drifted over the city sipping champagne. <laughs> Where's your ring? It's in the shop. <laughs> you know how antiques are. <laughs> Guys and girls treat engagements, you know, differently. First of all, all people should be allowed to be engaged and married. I'll say that. <laughs> Secondly, like, people were complimenting me, like, so excited for me. But for my guy friends announcing their engagements on Facebook, their guy friends were like, who's the ball and chain? I give it a year. Strip club bus tour. <laughs> The way they approach the actual event, it's almost like they're planning two different events, too. You know, like, for women, we'll say things like, this year is all about the wedding. <laughs> it's just a year of the wedding. And then guys, for guys, it just seems to be about cramming their penises into as many last-minute holes as they can before they have to settle on one person's holes. <laughs> for the rest of their lives. 